Man, a lot of y'all niggas, right, cuz? Y'all got that Will Smith spirit in y'all. Will Smith spirit? Yeah, y'all got that Will Smith spirit in y'all, man. Fighting over a, a bitch. And you're like, oh, no, that's his wife. No, it ain't. No, it ain't. No, it ain't. She just got the title of wife. The state recognized that. She does nothing that says wife. That's somebody else's broad. Man, been, that broad been disrespecting you in public. That broad been, been doing everything but being in her place. But then for you to sit over there, you understand me, and take your frustrations out, my nigga, on another dude about emotionally responding instead of sitting over there checking that bitch years ago. You got problems, man. That's, that's a lot of y'all problems, man. Y'all fighting over bitches, man, that don't even want y'all. Y'all fighting over bitches who be doing the most, who be doing all this extra shit, who be disrespecting y'all, and y'all fighting over them. For what? And y'all fighting over no good-ass bitches. Nigga, who the fuck is Jada Pinkett Smith, bro? Jada Pinkett Shakur, as a nigga would say. <laughs> who the fuck is her? To sit over there and take that disrespect. Y'all really be fighting over these bras that a year later, y'all don't even talk to no more. And it started early, dude. My brother was telling me, man, how uh, uh, how his partner, you feel me, uh, pretty much, you know what I'm saying, the bitch was passed around from one of the homies to the next uh, in his camp. And they fighting over the bitch. I'm looking like fighting over the bitch. For what? The bitch gonna do, the bitch is probably just laughing at y'all niggas, man. The bitch probably don't even want none of y'all niggas. And you fighting over it. For what? Why are you fighting over the broad? Why are you putting everything you worked for in jeopardy over a broad? Nigga, when you got a woman, my nigga, you should be at peace, my nigga, and obtaining even more, my nigga, with the broad. She should be so beneficial to your life. She should be fighting for you. But you fighting over a broad who don't even want you. You know how dumb you look? Fighting over pussy? You know how dumb you look? That's sad. You a simp. That's crazy. You fighting over a help me. There's plenty of them. When one don't work out, get you another one. A lot of these bras got expirations date and you fighting over them. You look silly as hell. You look silly fighting over pussy, bro. You look silly, bro. I never understood that. You fighting over a broad. Now, there is times where you're going to have to put it down or you might have to put it down for a broad that's for you, right? You know what I'm saying? Broad might be in danger and that's your broad, you feel me? She doing what's vital to the title of what a wife is. Because a wife, to me, my nigga, has nothing to do with title. It has something to do with actions. Your heart, your mind. Your spirit. That's wife. When she commits herself, you feel me, to you. When a woman commit herself to me and she's in danger, hey, I'm in danger. Oh, my mama, nigga, I'm hopping in that car. Nigga, what? I'm going to get her out that situation. I'm protecting, you feel me, my investor. She invested her time, her life, and resources into me. There is, there is times where you're going to have to put it down. Or not saying you have to put it down. You might have to put it down. But usually when she moving and grooving like a wife, she more times than not, she ain't going to put her position. She ain't going to put herself in predicament for you to even have to do that. Because if you're giving her these instructions, you feel me, on how to move out here, you feel me, and how to, you know what I'm saying? 
You ain't going to have to deal with that shit. But, yeah, there's times where a motherfucker might get out of line. And you're going to have to put that motherfucker in line, though. But more times than not, nine times out of ten, you niggas fighting over bitches, my nigga, who don't even want y'all. Who ain't doing shit for y'all. Who ain't shit. No, none of that. Who ain't doing nothing that's vital to the title of wife. That's who y'all fighting over. Sad. Sad. For instance, nigga, I got my broad, you feel me? Uh, she, You know what I mean? She's standing around here, a motherfucker, just, you feel me? Just doing hella much. Say, for instance, if I got my broad, she actually my bra. She actually doing what's vital to the title of a wife. Say, friend, let's give you an example. Say, for instance, nigga just walked up and just pushed the bra. And that's that's the bra that submitted and committed to this cripping. I'm getting off. I'm getting off. I'm getting off. That's just an example. Of course, nigga, nigga like me ain't gonna sit over and let that shit. But that's just an example. You feel me? I'm not protecting any bitch who is not submitted and committed. I'm not protecting any bitch who's not submitted and committed. So if you ain't submitted and committed, bitch, you would not get this protection. But y'all sitting over there, my nigga, putting y'all, everything y'all work for and putting y'all life on the line and dying over these bitches who don't even want y'all. Y'all got to do better than that, bro. Y'all got to do better than that. If when you sit back, you feel me? And when y'all done talking to the bitch, and y'all sit back like, yeah, man, that bitch really wasn't shit. Yeah, why the fuck did I, I stay that long? Type shit. And y'all wonder like, what the fuck was I thinking? When y'all sit over there, got that cold reminiscing shit like you married Jay Blige, nigga. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You look stupid. You are stupid. Knock that shit off. But y'all like, comment, and subscribe, though. For all my non-Will Smiths and my Will Smith-type niggas.